Heaven Fin. Oh. Oh, there's some eager beavers there. This guy just won't die. Crazy guys and girls and fellow gamers, my name is Games for Kicks and welcome back to War of the Walkers. We're back here at the retirement home. Um, the days have moved on, you will probably have noticed that. We have set the daytime back to 120 minutes because of all the looting and the building we want to do as well. Um, maybe not today, but um, we hopefully get back home making a lot of money along the way um, in this episode. Now, what we did is we streamed for about two hours, just over two hours, just looting. Yeah. Now, I didn't go into any major new areas, so don't worry about that. We looted basically where we already looted just more of the boxes, more of the same, um, loads of coins, things like that. So more of the same loot, actually. And we also cleared out the farm area. We got all the fertilizer out, um, 117 fertilizer in total. And we probably could have gotten more if we would have used an auger, but I didn't have an auger on me. Then this is what we got. 84 um, chrysanthemum we got loads of blueberries loads of spuds loads of coffee loads of corn and so on and so on um we also got loads more silver and gold and diamonds you can see here we got loads of silver nuggets but we're not going to sell them because they're actually part of recipes and the gold as well so we don't want to really sell them we want to keep them now what we're going to do today is we're going to go into the actual bookstore there is a bookstore in there which i didn't realize and thanks for pointing that out in the comments and we're going to cover that one thing i want to quickly touch upon though before we start is the coldness as you can see I'm at about six degrees, whatever, yeah? Because I'm wearing a hazmat pants, which is plus three. I'm wearing a brown shirt, which is plus one. I probably should repair that. I'm wearing a plaque puffer coat, which is plus 22. And I think this one probably works better if we actually would repair that. And we are in total at plus whatever. We are at minus 23 outside temperature. Now we're not wet at the moment and that's okay. But if we get wet, the reason my wetness didn't try, and somebody explained it to me on the stream, is because the game doesn't actually um, consider your body temperature, it considers the outside temperature. So you could theoretically, if you could find all the hazmat suits and whatever, and you could get yourself, say, right now to about plus 30 degrees with clothes, you would still not dry because the outside temperature is minus 23 and it seems to only care about the outside temperature that's it it doesn't care about how hot or cold you are on your body when it comes to wetness that is just hypothermia and all that like that cares about that so we had to go to the burnt biome all the way here for the outside temperature to rise up again and i think at about 10 degrees around there we started drying so we even though it was 10 degrees we could have taken off all our clothes to just stay at 10 degrees, we would have dried. But if you are at 20 degrees body temperature and minus 23 outside, you wouldn't have dried. So I don't know if that explained correctly, but that's basically the gist of it. So it has nothing to do with putting clothes on or off or something. It's basically just the game not giving a crap about your temperature when it comes to wetness, except for the outside temperature. Now, what we looted as well, we looted this little store here, which just had a, a couple of uh, gun, gun safes in it. So again, more of the same. We have a lot of guns that we can sell now, which is absolutely fantastic loads of ammunition um, we also got the final protection class fragment now this is the fragments we're still looking for in the moment we're still we're still trying to find more of these the marksman we actually have the a and the c so the b would be nice and the electrician so what i was trying to do in this episode um, was go to the actual bookstore that we have here to get as many fragments as possible and um, hopefully find um for, sorry schematics as possible and to hopefully find fragments among them our quality joe is max we leveled up a few times doing all the looting and fighting some zombies so we are now quality joe all the way up to the top and um, we spent 32 points on it and our scavenging is at 60. so loot quality obviously would go up if we go all the way up to whatever it is like um, the last level it would go up to plus 50 i think in total so we, we still can improve yeah but i'm not going to spend the points on that that's not going to happen okay look at that we're actually heating up more that's amazing how do we heat up more all of a sudden when it's the same outside temperature i don't know i don't understand it i don't get it i don't need to understand it it's just great so let me get ready i have to make a little bit more room merge a couple of more guns gun parts together so uh, that we have room for recipes and then hopefully we can find more fragments which would be absolutely amazing usually i wouldn't loot with a quite full inventory but just in case we get overwhelmed and we need to gtfo 
I just don't want to leave anything behind. So I got more stuff on me. I merged some things together. So hopefully we're going to be okay. Now, this here is also the pool that goes into the underground area. If you have never been in this uh, POI, the underground area is absolutely amazing. And we already can hear a zombie. That is insane. Oh my God. Okay, that's fine. They're not running. Are they not? Okay, he's running. There we go. As long as we stay cool, we should be okay. There we go. As long as we don't make noise. Now, I know in the last episode I used... Oh, covert class? No, we don't need covert class. I think covert class is done. So I'm not going to pick up any of that nonsense now because I think the covert class is done. Let me just double, double check. No, not here. Sorry. Covert. Yeah, it's done. So covert class done. Not going to take this with us because we don't want to keep, we don't want to fill up on anything that we don't need. Now, we do scrap, it's always important, and we're going to scrap what we can scrap, of course. Now. Okay, that's a shower. Very nice. I like the idea of the faucet. That's the toilet. And here we go. Let's go upstairs. It's okay. We just have to stay calm. There we go. Just stay calm. That's all it takes. Yeah, we wait until it gets infected or something and we have uh, the cure downstairs, so it's fine. Excellent. Now. Oh, they're cabinets. Okay, are these actually bookshelves now? No, they're not. Nice. These ones are bookshelves. Good. Is there any more zombies here? we need to clear out there we go okay oh that's a drawer okay also you guys are full of good ideas um you were saying if i use a paintbrush i can actually just run the paintbrush over these and uh, that will show you what it actually is. Which is really clever, because with the paintbrush you can just remove paint. So you can just run through a building really quickly and remove all the paint, and that's it. Now, if we get the reason I don't uh, panic so much if there's one glowing zombie, even if they're running, is um, I have quite high armor. So they, they need to beat me quite some time to actually get to me. So let's see what we have here. Oh, these things are always good. We're going to read them right away because this is like mining tools. All these things are really, really good straight away for reading. Nice. I, I'm enjoying that very much. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, there's a black bookcase. And then again, their rifle magazine construction tools. Very, very nice. So I can imagine after we're going to try to collect all of them if we can. That would be awesome. Oh, is that a fake one? Oh, that's not a real one. Okay, so every second one. Well, I suppose better than nothing. Yeah, we're gonna try to see if we can uh, stack them up. Um, this one here we will scrap, of course. There we go, we scrap that as well. And we're going to keep all the blueprints from now on because I didn't realize that we can actually craft with them. Um, we did a test during the stream where we spawned in some of those schematic crates that you can craft, and they don't seem to contain fragments. They only seem to contain more... Um, recipes like that because um, oh scavenging yes we're gonna read that straight away there's no point holding back on that and um, yeah we're gonna need the room <laughs> so we don't have a choice actually but to read it um, you can craft with the schematics with these guys I'll show you this now actually construction tools recipes uh, these schematic crates and we spawned one of each in and checked it out and we didn't keep the recipes we deleted it again and um, just to see how it works and what could be in it and um that's more drawers i don't think there's anything in those drawers shenanigans to you you just want me to start wasting my time destroying them 
Oh, nice. Look at that. Two sides. That is awesome. I don't know if there is actually any schematics. So if you're missing schematics in general, um, just um, not the... Not these type of schematics, but the schematics like the say the ogre or something like uh, you crafting these uh, these um, chests would probably give you a high chance of, of finding the, the missing uh, fragments. Look at that, nice. Oh, bladed weapons always very good. I'm liking that, and more pistols, excellent. Okay, we have all we already have that. Nice! We actually found some free paper. Okay, let's read that. Fire schema. We already know that. And this one. Then, oh, that's drawers again. Here we go. Here's another bookcase. Oh, lovely. That is a lot of um, blueprints. Nice. And yes, if you have multiple of the same recipes on top of each other, you get more blueprints. Oh man, there's one outside. He gave me such a fright. I thought it was right beside me inside here. Look, there, for example, we have two. If we scrub two at the same time, we get seven. We only get three each. So I think it goes the same as with, it does with other stacks. When you have four of them, you get the optimal, which is like 15 or some nonsense like that. So, um, so yeah, if you have the room, absolutely. Always uh, loot all the bookstores first and then do the scrapping in the end only so you can maximize your return on blueprints. Definitely recommend it. But right now, space is at a premium because we want to literally be able to get out if um, the heat get, if the heat comes on. Nice, we actually found a recipe. That is awesome that we didn't have yet. That is pretty sweet. Okay. In a way, I'm glad it's only every second one because it would have taken forever otherwise. Okay, we already know that one. We definitely know the brew and the pie. We already know that as well. I'm, I'm waiting for fragments here, but I don't think fragments are gonna be a thing that we're gonna find in the bookshelves. I have a feeling that we are not. Okay, so we already know that. Oh, nice. Excellent stuff. We can make the helmet now as well, which is sweet. Auger, we already have that. Let's see what else we have in here. I'm trying to hurry up a little bit. I don't want to cut it out because I kind of know that you guys want to see what drops. And... Um, you know, especially in the POIs like these that you know you probably haven't been in before, that you can see how much there's actually to loot and if it's worth it, it's definitely worth it, absolutely. Oh, look at that, nice. You get two of each. I mean, that is because our um, quality Joe is up, I suppose, at our um, scavenging as well. Okay, we can scrap that and scrap that. We might as well quickly read these guys. Make a little bit more room. Nice. Mining tools is now level 96. You see how the mining tool, how this helps now. That is so awesome. And then rifles, uh, they are mining tools 97. That is amazing. We're going to get it to 100 in no time. Oh, nice. Yeah, we already have that. Schematic as well. Yeah, we could have had a nice uh, four auger scrap, I suppose. But you just don't know what it's going to drop. And if you don't have the room, it's like, no, you can't keep it, man. Okay, so we have... Oh, this is an absolute amazing... It looked so small originally. I was like, eh, it's not going to be a lot of bookshelves in here, like if it's only every second row. But it actually is front to back. So it gives you a lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of, a lot of good loot. All right. I know a lot of you don't like the looting episodes and, well, not as many. A lot of you like them, actually. But um, we're going to go back to building after that. And then after Horde Night, we will be coming back here to go to the underground because we literally want to see every single bit of this retirement home this time around um, before Alpha 17 drops. There's more drawers. Oh, yeah, look at that. We already have 166. That is amazing.
Yeah, I definitely would recommend not to scrap them until you're finished if you're doing that by yourself. Get a loot container outside and just dump all the recipes in. Okay, wow. And usually it's divisible by four, which means as soon as you scrap five, you're back to losing uh, more. So it always has to be a divisible by four. Well, if it follows the same logic as the other ones does do. Nice. Okay. And the last one. Hammer, no fragments. That is really disappointing. I really would have th thought now that... Now, again, like I said, I'm not too hung up anymore about the fragments. And when we get them, great, wonderful. But I would have assumed that in a library, you would find one or two fragments. I would have assumed that now. Okay, I'm gonna do one more and see if there's... I, I mean, the last draws, there was nothing in any of them. Yeah, no, they just seem to be empty. Screw that. Not falling for that anymore. Um, these are just fake books. Okay. And is there another upstairs or anything? Is there any more upstairs? No, I don't think so. I think that's literally it. Yeah. Nothing more. And where's the stairs? Where's the stairwell? Where was the stairwell? Here. Let's see what's in here. I think that just goes to... Ooh, what is that? Oh, it goes to the outside. Yes, 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 yes. All right, and then we also have... Oh, look at that. We have a nice green guy spawned in there. And then we also have the hospital area. And that will obviously be full of medicine and whatnot. And oh, look at that. Oh, that goes in the undergrounds now. Oh, my balls. Look at that. Furnace? Okay. Oh, this is the... Um... Hey, Dylan, how are you? You have flannel pants. Okay, we're gonna use that. I haven't been... Oh... Oh, there's some eager beavers there. This guy just won't die. I know I'm bleeding. Okay. Okay, let's quickly heal. Okay. Let's see what the story is upstairs here. Yeah, the lag is real. You're gonna try to stay calm. Shit! She had a lot of stuff on it. Oh, I want that. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to go. We're gonna have to go. I'm trying to be as calm as possible here because I know I'm gonna die if I don't. Yeah, I knew that the shotgun is gonna attract them. So yes, you don't need to tell me in the comments. Well, you don't have to be surprised if you use the shotgun. I know. <laughs> but sometimes you just need the firepower. You see, this is, we looted all of that in there. Um, that was, again, these were more tasks which are very well suited for streaming because it was just digging, digging, digging. And then on stream, we kind of were able to say like, okay, how much do you think we're gonna get, you know? And I'm not opening this crate yet. 
there you go we actually don't need that we can scrap that but hey there's some iron arrows which are worth nothing <laughs> We can use that. Let's put the paper away. And look at that. We have 250 of those guys. That is absolutely amazing. They don't seem to ever come out. We don't need the glass, so we can put more of these guys in. There we go. Nice. Now we even have a little bit more room. Oh, look at that. We have actually no drink. So we can drink that. And let me see. What else? We don't have any more drink? Huh. Okay, that's interesting. Well, I suppose... Oh, yeah, we have some food in here. There we go. And then for hydration, I suppose we can... Um, we have snow here, so if we want to, we can just cook up a couple of jars. Actually, before they despawn, I probably should pick them up then. There you go. And we can quickly fill, uh, fill them up with snow. Yeah, murky water. We can't drink it. We don't have actually a pot to cook anything. So we weren't able to drink it, but luckily we have... Oh, this is going to be... Um, that is better, yeah. And we're full. Excellent, yeah, we're going to leave that here. Let's turn the fire off so we don't have any screamers. Yeah, murky water, I can't. It's pointless because we don't have a pot. Now, off we go. Is there anything else we want to take that we might sell for a good bit of money? Let me see, I already took most of the guns with us. Um, we probably won't be able to sell them all anyway. Tungsten crossbow balls, tungsten mini bike chassis. Oh, that's another 2000. And there you go, we're gonna pick that one up as well. And I think that's it. Yeah, we just have a couple of parts here, which I'm going to leave in because I don't want to sell them. They're actually really good parts, so we want to come back here at some point and repair them. So let's have a look and see if we can find a trader. So I was driving around a little bit now, and I don't think I can see anything there. But look at this. There's a town here. There's a town here. There's a town here. This is Loot Central, guys. You can see the coordinates where my mouse is over right here. So if you're playing the same seed... Good luck, knock yourself out. It's gonna be awesome. But you know what's awesome? Look over here to the right. There is two pirate ships right beside each other. How awesome is that? Unless one of them was a mirage. You know, one of the things that as you get close, it disappears. I hope not, because that would have been, that, that would be too awesome. I saw it from up the hill. There's one. One is rendering in now. And the other one is right behind it. Oh, no, it disappeared, did it? I think it did. Oh, it would... there it is, yes! Oh, it is right behind it. That is so cool. That is awesome. Anyway, I think we're better off heading home and we're just going to use one of the traders on the way home. Oh, unless that is the trader here. That would be pretty neat, though there is another town up here as well. So, um... oh, anything square, I'm always investigating because that could be a class trader which is something very very handy because they're the ones more likely to have fragments with all their vending machines so let's see what we have here no it's a normal building i thought it was one of those square boxes absolutely normal building okay excellent we don't have to stay here there's nothing to see here okay there's one trader we might as well stop by here and then we have a class trader as well further down there we go, nice. I also found another uh, loot box, or two loot boxes, so we have loads of things that we were able to scrap, plus we had a couple of more attachments we were able to um, scavenge. Okay, oh, there you go. You need to buy something. No, actually, I'm here to sell, and sell big, guys. <laughs> like, really big. Okay, so... Now, when it comes to selling, we are selling the lowest one first because the biggest ones, once we know how to craft it, once we have the recipe, we actually um, will... Oh, that hang on a second, there's bullets in there. And that's all you buy? Oh, hang on, there's, there's bullets in there and we can't deassemble it. Can we get rid of them? Well, if you got money, I guess I can stand your smell. 
Okay, I suppose um, we're going to make sure that. Do some book learning at Born and Noble, cause you're dumber than dirt. You're dumber dirt. Yeah, that's why when you speak, Watch everything yourself, makes sense. Stranger, I know some fellers who break legs for coin. Okay, that's well, fine. If you got money, now, I guess I can stand your smell. What is that? Oh, that's my wood. Ah, well, I have my wood on this table. Money, anyway, um, stand your smell. Let's sell that. Let's sell that. And can we sell that? Excellent. Now we shouldn't be able to sell this. No, because it's only three. Okay, so now the same for the Desert Eagle. I'm gonna sell this and that. I know it had bullets in it, but you know what? It doesn't matter anymore. Okay, that's it. That's all we can sell. Oh, 32,000 holy balls. Now, um, let's see. What else do we have? Yes, we want to sell all of these. We want to sell all of the um, not steel crossbow balls. Where's the other ones? There, the tungsten arrows. That's 8,000. There we go. Nice. We also want to sell the lower pistols if we can. Okay, that's fine. We're going to keep that. And we're going to sell the lower level Remingtons. There we go. Nice. Awesome. And then the SMGs as well. Okay, and the low sniper rifle as well. I think that's pretty much it. Now we want to open this to All see what's right, in there. Now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Oh yeah, of course we can't place it here because we're too close to the area. I'm sorry. We have to place it somewhere here. Hopefully we can. Let me see. Nice. Let's see weapon supply crate. Oh, lovely. Good parts, good parts, hunting rifle, excellent stuff. Let me see, actually. Oops, let me see, actually. Um, hunting rifle that we have currently on us. Assemble. Okay, and 408. Is that better? No, it's not. Cool. And now we can actually repair that. Look at that for awesome. Nice, which means we can sell these two parts here. Excellent. More money for us. Well, if you got money, I guess I can stand your smell. There we go. Nice. Okay, so let's see if you have any fragments. You have a fighter class fragment? I already have the fighter class. So let me see. Fragments? No, nope, no fragments here. But do you have... Actually, do you have the farmer's recipe? That would be really handy. But you have a very lovely AK-47. And I love the AK-47. And I love buying all the bullets, definitely all the bullets. And we have that, we have that, a player vending machine. Oh, that's the normal vending machine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not the class specific one. That makes sense. A solar bank. Ooh, okay. Let's buy all these bullets as well. There we go. We're now leveled up. Nice. Okay, I think we should buy this. Because we have loads of money. We have loads more money in the truck. And AK-47s are nice. Oh, that has good parts. We definitely should buy it. And we can merge it together with the ones we have at home. And I want to also buy a mining helmet. I know I have one because I want Careful to wear that mining there. helmet. So I can finally oh, wear my mining helmet with my uh, uh, night vision goggles. Because this one, I can't wear both. Which is really Make annoying me. Snappy. I gotta take a crap. Well, you do that then, good sir. Don't mind me. And that's it. I think that's it. We don't need any more. Nope. Everything else is hunky-dory. Well, we might actually buy the motion sensors because we need them as well to make um, motion. Is there any more? No. Turrets? Nope. Okay. Rebar? Nope. We already know that. Yeah. Cha -ching. Excellent. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Whew. That's it. Yeah, we already know this guy. Now we're going to go down to the class vendor and pretty much do the same thing. Just checking out if he has any new things, any more fragments. But yeah, what I can do now is I can now put the night vision goggles on. Where's my night vision goggles? There we go. We can wear it now. Oh, no, we can't. Oh, what the balls, man. 
Ah, come on. We're supposed to be able to wear both. There we are. Huh? Okay, that was weird. Oh, because I replaced... Yeah, look at that now. If I do that... And then that... Okay, that was really weird. Yeah, excellent. That's much better. Wow! Okay, that was just weird on so many levels. And look at all the money we have now. That is insane. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and nearly ten. So that's two hundred thousand. That is amazing. Anyway, guys, that was probably the last loot episode for a while because we're going to be focusing on getting our build up and running now. We have so many... Like, we have to go on a little bit of resource grind, but I can do that off camera as well. Um, go for loads and loads of stone. Um, start queuing up that cement and the concrete mix and all that jazz. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, let me know what you think of all the loot like in this in this retirement home and if you want to go back there to look at the rest of the retirement home please let me know in the comments below and if you are and if you um don't know the retirement home yet and you haven't seen it before let me also know in the comments below because that will make it even more exciting to go back to show you guys the rest anyway if you did enjoy it, remember to kick that like button in the balls and i hope to see you guys in the next episode and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys next time until then as always feel spaz and happy gaming okay so he has the marksman class a which we already have a and c we have Covert class, we already have that, but Scholar class, yeah, we need the Scholar class. I actually don't know if we need B, but we definitely need the Scholar class. So does he have any other fragments? No. Oh, you have some oh outer turrets? Nah, I need the shotgun turret, man. Do you have any... Oh, this mining helmet is so much better, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, do you have any fragments here? No. Oh, you have... That's 42,000. Oh, yeah. 500 steel upgrades. That's 50 blocks we can upgrade with fire retardants. Oh, man. That would be amazing. No, we need steel first. Steel is more important. Safe wow. Travels. Okay, let's check the vending machines uh, quickly. I don't think they have refreshed yet. Um, we're actually going to buy all that steel as well.